People who live in a South Omaha neighborhood are frustrated. It has to do with a homeless encampment that's taken over a private property near L and 22nd Street. It's right across the street from Omaha South. And along with the trash, one neighbor tells us she witnessed a disgusting act. Our Johan Marin joins us now live from this site with how the city is working to find a solution. Yeah, John and Lauren, as you can see, there are furniture, bike wheels, and many discarded food items in this area. And this is what neighbors have to deal with every single day, whether that's driving by or walking near the sidewalk. It's just one thing or another. You have somebody who's literally spreading their stuff out all over the sidewalk, all over the side, hanging out in the tree, maybe using the restroom. Victoria K. Spear drives by 22nd and L Street every day to drop off her daughter at school. She lives just a block away from the intersection. One time we were driving by and there was somebody defecating on the sidewalk. But this isn't the only thing she sees. She notices piles of empty bottles, furniture, and discarded food pile up every day. And has been told some of the people living on the property have been knocking on neighbors' doors. It's not only South Omaha, it's downtown Omaha. It's North Omaha and, you know, you don't see many homeless people in West Omaha. Six News reached out to the city homeless coordinator, Tamara Dwyer. She told us she's been keeping an eye on the property for weeks. Like I told you, it had been in process with outreach connecting with folks and um, trying to locate people that are staying here. Dwyer says it's become a common issue in the metro for people to camp in city and private properties, an issue she's trying to resolve. My next steps would be to give uh, code enforcement the go ahead to send a letter or connect with the property owner or try to connect with the property owner myself. She's working to clean up this area and find a place people staying overnight in this area can call home. Right now, currently, I'm working on um, strengthening processes within the city to work more collaboratively to respond to these kinds of situations quickly. Yeah, right now the city is currently the city is currently looking for all the people that are staying here overnight. But Dwyer was actually here earlier talking to all those people and telling them to clean up their items and trash. But she says that this whole process will take a while and we'll keep you updated. Live in South <laughs> Omaha, Johan Marin, 6 News. Johan.